weeks or helping your family get back to school, breaking down this unprecedented year. This fall is the first time some students will be returning back to the classroom in two years. You just heard from the Hamburg School Superintendent saying how necessary it was to be back to school in person five days a week, but getting there and getting them to school could be easier said than done. Seven Eyewitness News reporter Taylor Epps live for us in Niagara Falls, breaking down the impact of a shortage of bus drivers and what that could mean for your family and your child's commute to school. Taylor, good morning. Ed and Katie, good morning. Well, if you drive past just about any school in Western New York, you'll probably see a big yellow bus outside with a big sign saying bus drivers needed. And that's certainly the case here in Niagara Falls. And they work with a company called Niagara Falls Coach Lines. I caught up with the president there who says they only have about half of the drivers they need to start the school year. Now he says the shortage started uh, just a couple years ago, but this year it's only gotten worse. So they've been negotiating pay rates, raising up to $20 an hour with room to grow from there. He says they make the application process easy with a background check and free training on site. President Michael Dow tells me if they don't get these drivers, there will be a huge negative impact. And that, of course, is overcrowded buses. Uh, the impact on that is more stops and more delays for students. Uh, and a really big impact is it frustrates the administrators and, more importantly, parents because their kids are arriving late, they're concerned about them. Dowd says this also frustrates current bus drivers. These drivers have to take longer routes and make more stops. And if they are late, parents sometimes get upset and take it out on those drivers. Now, if you are interested in helping out and helping out with this job, you can go straight down to Niagara Falls Coach Lines or just give them a call. There will also be a job training site and there's going to be a job fair this week and next week at Abbott Elementary. This Wednesday, the 18th from 1 to 3 and next week, Tuesday through Thursday. We'll have all that information for you on our website at WKB. W.com. You can walk right out of there with a job. For now, we're live in Niagara Falls. Taylor Reps, 7 Eyewitness News. Certainly feels like it's going to be a tumultuous start to the school year, to say right. the least, but we need to get these people back into jobs and behind the wheel of these school buses. Taylor, thank you. If you 